good morning and happy Sunday from Cape Verde. Look at this beach and this ocean. It is absolutely amazing. We're having a beach day today, as we are most days, but we're having a bit of a swimming and windsurfing. Ginny and Hammett are gonna be doing that. So we have set up camp on the beach and everyone's just kind of going off and doing their thing. And I've taken some Instagram photos today. Who knows how they turned out? Mine never look as good as other people's. <laughs> Instagram but you know I just keep it real so hopefully they look okay and it's difficult for me to walk in the sand I've discovered because of my balance but I'm getting there and I'm even going to have a bit of a paddle in the sea so as you can hear the waves are pretty big and Ian is now in the water which is pretty cold but it is hot out here I think it's about 25 degrees or something um, but obviously the water is still cold but once you're in it's fine I think I do not go in because of fish obviously I'm allowing a little bit of paddling, which is brave for me. So Hammett was up and going, but it now appears that he isn't. <laughs> He's fallen off. Sorry if the picture isn't great, I'm zoomed all the way in, so it might be a little bit jerky. Here comes Jenny though. Yep, Jenny is on a roll. I would wave at her, but then I feel like if she tries to wave back, she'll fall off. She definitely will, <laughs> so let's not do that. <laughs> And I think they've got two hours of windsurfing and it was 60 euros. I think so. Just for those of you who are into this type of thing, I definitely am not, but... Oh, is Jenny coming all the way in? Oh, maybe. Not quite sure what's going on here, but something is. Don't think she's coming out. Maybe she's switching board or something. Mm. So, my beginner's lesson has quickly turned into an intermediate's lesson. Ah. <laughs> That's good, That's good. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> And you got some crazy utility belt. Does that, attach, does that attach you to the sail, does it? Yes, so you've got the boom going across and then there's like a little loop ah, there. Ah, okay. So you can lean your whole whilst, weight against the sail. Whilst coming along, you're supposed to try and not look, but put this thing onto the, onto oh. the over there, whilst not falling in. Whilst <laughs> this sounds like fun. Yeah. Yeah, so what, then you can lean with your whole weight so against the sail? Your body rather than your arms, it's coming from the waist rather than... Ooh. <laughs> I nearly got attacked by the scabby dog. <laughs> There's a poor little scabby dog running around on the beach who I think is a stray. Oh, there he is. He's like bold on the... People keep trying to speak to him and he's just running away. <laughs> he looks like he's loving it though. Oh, Hammett's up out there. He's doing good. Yeah. So Ginny's getting ready for her intermediate wind sailing. Yep, she's just having a little... Um, wind sailing? Wind surfing. Wind surfing. She's just having a little lesson there. She's up and going. Good, good. And you see Hammett there in the background as well. And this is our little beach camp. Here's Jill, chilling. These things are a bit hit and miss. And um, we've been finding they don't overly keep the, <laughs> the sun off. It's not as sunny today, I don't think. Like not as burning sunshine. No, I don't think so. So we're just walking into the town, village, what is it? A town. town I suppose. Yeah. Capital of the island. The capital of the island. So we're headed to the ice cream place mm. and they've got some merchandise for sale, mainly magnets, hats, jewellery and the like. Yeah, and quite some sculptures and stuff. Yeah, I think we're going to get a magnet so we are just going to go and get ice cream first though because I'm actually a little hungry and I feel like that what? might might help. These look so good. <laughs> So I have pineapple, papaya and biscotti flavour. I've got all kinds of chocolatey stuff. Ian's got all kinds of chocolatey stuff and Jenny I has... I can't remember, I got excited, it's yeah. all good. Jenny's got three flavours in a cone, yeah. but they're melting rapidly so we need to eat these, it's so hot. We are headed back because it's the hottest time of the day, it's like 3pm, everyone is roasting. We were trying to get some cash out but it was proving very unsuccessful. So sometimes when you go abroad, I know when we were in South Korea, we just couldn't get money out of the cash point. It didn't like our card or whatever. So, and we were in a group of 12 people. I think two people managed to get cash out. So kind of weird, but I don't know what's going on there. So we're just taking a refuge in the shade, trying another cash point. And Jenny was saying that um, she was worried you guys might think she was doing the tourist walk, which is, is when people walk along like that. But, I was um, actually just shading my arms. Yes, she's so feeling a bit burned. If I flashed a look, it was out of, oh no, I'm tourist walking. 
And also, this is the t-shirt I got Jenny. I didn't show you in the hall because obviously you would have seen it. Um, I like bikini. Marks. Oh yeah, this is bikini, not sweat. <laughs> by the way. But yeah, it's a Toy Story shirt. I got this in the outlets at the Vineland ones. Hey everyone, so we are back at our room. I've just got ready for this evening. We are gonna go to a little restaurant across the road. It's not very far. Um, the food here at the hotel is good for breakfast and just for like snacks and stuff. It's all inclusive. But for dinner, we're not a huge fan of the kind of um, buffet. We call them the troughs in our family, which sounds <laughs> terrible, I know. Um, but that's just what we call them. And um, when you're on an all inclusive holiday, and they're fine but there's just a not there's not that much variety and I'm a little bit fussy and so is Ian so we're going to go to this little bistro restaurant and I think on the last night we're going back to Palm Beach which is the one we went to for Jenny's birthday I'm not going to take the camera with me because it's kind of bulky to carry when I don't have a bag to fit it in and we're just having like a bit of a date night so I will see you guys when we get back good morning it is our last day in Cape Verde I haven't vlogged every single day of this trip because to be honest a lot of the days have been exactly the same. We've just been chilling, sunbathing at the beach um, and you know how these kind of holidays go. So we are just about to go to breakfast or I am. Ian is being a bit slow moving this morning so he is gonna meet us down on the beach and we're gonna be doing a bit more tanning. This trip I got burned at the beginning and then I stayed out of the sun to obviously recover from that. And I've got a bit of color now so I feel like I can at least try and get a bit of a tan on my legs which never happens. You know how pale I am. So we're gonna do that. Then this evening we are going back to Palm Beach which is the restaurant we went to for Jenny's birthday. It was so good there. Last night we went to the casino down the road which was kind of like just a very little casino and uh, just played a bit of roulette, I think. I didn't play anything, but the guys did, and Jenny. And Jenny and Hammett actually won some money, so that was quite nice. Ian did not, but we won't get, get into that. He's, he's, yeah, he's not very happy. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that is basically gonna be our day. We go tomorrow, and I think at about 12, we get picked up to go back to the airport. So tomorrow morning, we'll just be, you know, getting packed and getting sorted. I'm ready to go. So it's been an amazing trip and we've still got one more day, so it's not quite over yet. And I will be taking the camera with me today. So I will try and film a little bit, but like I said, we are basically just laying around a whole lot. So not an awful lot to film. But anyway, I will see you in a bit. So we are back at Palm Beach. This mm. is where we ate for Jenny's birthday. Yeah. And this is the one where the sand continues into the restaurant. Which is not great for your walking. Which is not great for walking, <laughs> but food is really good here and it's like a really good vibe, so we're excited. <laughs> Victoria is crying. Why are you crying? <laughs> because we're sat here, the toilet is there, and Jill just got lost in the way back from the toilet. So this is the toilet over here behind these guys on guitar. Mum wandered out here and started going over there. She's like, The drink has gone to Jill's head. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> who are who are these people? <laughs> How did they not fall out? <laughs> Good morning and welcome to our last day. We are, well, it's not even our last full day. Yesterday was our last full day. We are leaving Cape Verde today. We are being picked up around midday. So this morning is just packing and just grabbing some breakfast, which I'm gonna go and do now. And then there probably won't be much going on. So I don't know how long <laughs> this last bit of vlog will be, but I'll keep you updated of anything interesting. Ian is not feeling too good, so he's not gonna come down to breakfast. But I'm sure you will see him later. Later. So it is time to go. You can hear Ian kind 
closing up the suitcase and I have stupid UK clothes back on. Boom. So it's case closed, <laughs> literally. We are yeah. going, uh, we're checking out. We're just about to head down to the lobby and I think we've got about an hour-ish yeah. until our flight. So it's been amazing and very relaxing, which is something mm. we're not used to with our vacations. So that's been really nice. after our busy end of the year. <sighs> yeah, I was burned out for sure. So this has been so nice. Sorry about that, battery just died. <laughs> so. Now it is time to go. I think we're all packed. We're doing that thing where you're sure you've left something behind, mm. but hopefully not. So in order to make the most of our all-inclusive to the very last moment, we are just heading down to the hut. We call it the pizza hut because they have like little snacks and stuff here. There's basically food available all day long from one place or another. And um, Ian didn't have any breakfast, no. so um, he I needs a little... I time in bed this morning more than food. Yes. Which is rare for me. That is rare for you. Normally food's one of the only things that'll get me out of bed. Yeah, true. So yes, we will have this because we've got a six hour flight and then we don't get back to Gatwick until 10 or something. Yes, yeah, so we might grab something from M&S at the other end or whatever. Mm. So they have some pizza. They're quite big on pizza here in Cape Verde, which is good for me because I love a bit of pizza, <laughs> as you know. Ian's got some chicken nuggets. <laughs> so we've had our little snack. Hopefully that will tide us over. And um, they're doing some cleaning. I was going to say, this resort is so clean. Mm. Um, the rooms are really clean. All of the like public toilets around are so clean. Um, and some resorts you go to are a little bit iffy, um, but this is great. Oh, careful. <laughs> quick, quick, quick. quick. <laughs> <laughs> Almost got sprayed. And I don't think I've even said the name of the resort. Yeah, Oasis Atlantico. And this, this Salina resort sea. is Salinas. Salinas Sea. Because um, there's a couple with the same name, or similar names, I should say, like a sister hotel. Oh, and everybody is now here waiting to leave.